Hello world, this is Hacker 7 and today I will be doing a video on a theme called Alien Tech. It's a very cool theme. It's a little heavier red theme. Um, what I mean about heavy is it takes over more stuff. A little darker, more intense. Anyway, it is a very simple theme to install. Um, no system file replacements and let's get started. If you download the uh, file in the description below, you will get a folder called Alien Tech Theme. In there, you'll have uh, four items. We have a thanks.txt thing here. We have a fonts folder, which has some fonts. We have the theme files and theme resource changer. This is a special program that makes it all work. Theme resource changer is a program that allows the theme developers to, instead of making you replace the files, so for example, here I have wait themes. Okay, okay. So you guys can see right here. I have a file that we normally would have to um, rename our other one, replace with this one. And if you mess up, it can mess your computer up. Using Theme Resource Changer, the people who make the themes are now allowed to do things like this. Instead of making that file, they have to make a folder. In the folder, just put the pictures. So what this does is the program basically takes these folders and the pictures inside it and replaces them. Well, it doesn't replace them. It just like kind of puts it over the de default. So I will show you guys. It doesn't. Uh, you can revert back and forth. It's really simple. Anyway, so to install it, go to your start over here. Right click on computer. Go to properties and go the system type it's going to tell you a 64 bit or a 32 bit so open up your theme resource changer if it says 64 bit you're going to want to install the x64 if you have a 32 bit you're going to want to install the x86 um, you may have this program already installed if you use a different theme um, most themes don't use theme resource changer but it's a good program to have so we'll go ahead and install it so I have to use this one now I get this button right here because I have already installed now it's pretty simple just click next a bunch of times and uh, it will do everything by default then go ahead and restart your computer after you started it go ahead and apply the theme so to do that just uh, pin this to the side here open up your Windows and installation drive, go to your Windows folder, go down to resources, open your themes folder here, and open the themes folder here. Copy both of, copy both of these. Paste them in here. And there we go. So now we can go ahead and right click and go to personalize. And I do have some people ask me how do I get rid of the theme? Um, the simplest way is to really just do this right here is just to go here and get out of it so if you actually want to go delete it you can go ahead and delete it that way but anyway go here and click on it here is our theme so as you guys could see uh, we have this animated mouse cursor it actually moves if you can see up close we have a pretty cool wallpaper um, what else here so we have your cat custom taskbar, our custom start orb, um, the user picture has now been replaced. You guys can see the way it's designed, it actually allows you to have more um, icons on your side because now your documents are shoulder, so it's kind of like separate almost, that's how it works. Our power button's over here. And going through here, we have our custom back and forward buttons. We got rain meter skin, or they are custom clothes buttons. They'll lay up a certain color once you go over them. There's our right click menu. Alright, guys, so that's about it for this video. It's a pretty simple uh, theme to install. It's got some heavy looks to it, and it's a pretty decent theme. So, go ahead and download the description below. And besides that, guys, go ahead and subscribe for some more awesome Windows 7 tutorials and theme reviews. And besides that, have a great day.
This is the Hacker Triple O Seven, and I am signing off.